Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's time to do my weekly cash stuffing. I'm late with this video because it's supposed to be done on Saturday. But as I mentioned in my Christmas um, cash stuffing uh, yesterday, I was doing a Christmas shopping with my husband on Saturday. So it was a very busy day. Um, we I couldn't find the time to record a video. So here I am on Monday doing this uh, weekly cash stuffing. Um, it's not going to be a very long video. Now, if you haven't seen my Christmas uh, video yesterday, please go and check it out. Um, there is just like a small surprise um, in this video. So um, let's get into cash stuffing. <laughs> I hope your weekend was good. Um, we are in December, which is crazy. Um, it's amazing. It's nice, but at the same time, I don't. You feel you don't feel any kind of like under pressure to uh, get so many stuff because um, per Canada, they still have the post um, strikes. The post is on strike. I cannot imagine the building up the the backlog of delivering the packages, letters, Christmas cards, and different things. So um, it's definitely challenging for some people in Canada. Uh, I hope it will get sorted, but yeah, it's just, um, yeah, some of the things we got in the shops, but there are certain things that we need to order online, so we need to focus on those. Now, for today's video, I have 65, as you can see. I'm not putting a lot of money into it. I'm focusing on finishing the savings challenges. Um, now, so let's put that 65, so... I will need to take this binder because I will need this binder very, very soon. I need to set up my, um, not this binder. I, well, I need to set up my A4, uh, A4 yearly binder and I want to use this gray binder because I only have three savings challenges in here. So I'm focusing for that on them to, uh, to get them done because simply I just need a binders. I want to create something like I have it here. This is my yearly binder. I like to save small amounts each week to uh, save for uh, car insurance. This binder is for my car insurance. I always have it in January. I'm actually currently waiting for my insurance company for the quotation from them. Um, it's still nothing, but it's still quite early. Maybe next week, um, maybe in two weeks time, I will get some quotation. So I will know how much I will need to pay in January for the entire year. So that I want to set up exactly uh, same bind well this binder with different yearly saving challenge i already choose which one i want to do but i just need that binder for this uh, so the money stays here all year and i'm absolutely happy to to continue to do that to save up uh, this way because it's just um it's great idea it's just small amounts each week and eventually they all adds up. I know that I have the money saved for the car insurance and that's amazing. So last 10 for the last week of November. I need to take the uh, November week four. Um, this challenge was actually created by my sister. I love it. Um, she did it for an entire week, a uh, year, and she counted Thursdays for me in each month because I'm getting paid on Thursdays, same as my husband. So it's just easier for me. So some months we have five Thursdays. That's brilliant. This one is going back in here. So all we have left now is December. And in December is 60 euros. Well, this one is quite big because we have 20 that's okay and then i will take out the money put it into the bank and just wait for the insurance company i don't know how about you guys but every time when i'm getting a quotation from insurance company um they sending me an email or a letter saying that much you will need to pay for the year um you can pay for that straight away but i'm always ringing them i'm always ringing them to find out is there anything cheaper that you can do for me <laughs> i'm always doing this um, and you know what? It's always something cheaper. Like I'm ringing them. I said, look, is there any chance that you can just get some money off without obviously losing any uh, you know, benefits? And she said, she's always like, let me check. So it's always either 10 or 15 euros less on my car insurance. But why not? That's my 10 and 15 euros, not theirs. Do you know what I mean? Without losing any, um, you know, any um, benefits of the car insurance so if you can ring them why not um it's definitely better to uh, to ask if you don't ask you're not going to get so that binder is done now in this a5 binder i am doing the d plans and budget um saving challenge so i will complete that one today 
and I will still need these envelopes to set up the A5 binder as well. I still have three binders to three binders to set up. So yeah. And I just need the envelopes from this binder and I need this binder <laughs> from my yearly savings challenges. So for these, I am send, uh, I'm saving five for the turkey. Um, so this is the five and this is the last uh, icon. So bear with me. Okay, that's perfect. Oh, no. I, okay, I'm going to remove that later. So this is my D plans and budgets. This was a freebie for the entire year from, from D. So D, thank you so much. But I'm not keeping the money. I'm taking the money. So this is another uh, saving challenge uh, complete, which is great. And now we be moving to December next week. We have snowflakes and ornaments and coffee. So yeah, we will do that. Um next month that's perfect that's done and now we need to move to this challenge How I? Well, well i will remove it don't mind that <laughs> okay now the big story about the spare chain challenge the spare chain challenge is complete and i will have a screenshot for you here um this was a saving account named exactly like spare, like this challenge which is the spare chain challenge and I transferred my spare change on Wednesday and I realized I only need nine euros and I believe two cents to complete the entire challenge. So I didn't want to wait until next week. I just transferred the whole entire money. So I have 667 and 95 cents saved in this account. I also transferred 23 euros into my 50 envelope challenge. So I only have one envelope left with 26 here. And um, so I will do that next week. So what I'm going to do then, I will still continue to save digitally, but I'm not going to keep a track. I really like the idea of saving spare chain challenge the way how I'm doing. And the way, my way of doing this, because I wouldn't have that much coins each week uh, to do this challenge. Um, it's just, um, most of the time I'm paying using my card, my debit card or cash and it's just um yeah i wouldn't have that much coins so each wednesday because my husband and myself we're getting paid on thursdays so each wednesday when i'm sitting at home in the evening afternoon when i know that we're not going to spend the money on anything that we're not going to the shop the kids are home nobody wants any money so i'm just checking our current account and our current account is a joint account where the money is going in but then i'm taking the money out for bills, if I can pay them using cash, uh, transfer to loans, transfer to savings account. So basically current account is only for direct debits or bills that has to be paid digitally like phone or internet or broadband. So that's, um, that's what we have. So then current account, we don't really have much money on that account. It's just coming and the money is going <laughs> straight away. But of course I'm not, we are not spending everything. Um, from this account so I each Wednesday I'm just checking my current account and let's say this is just a pure example if I have 212 euros and 55 cents left in this account then I would transfer that 1255 into the spare change um, just kind of a rounding to the nearest zero or five if you know what I mean I wouldn't put more than 20 euros of course because that's not spare change. Um, so that's, I like the way this way. It all adds up, guys. I already have saved 600 euros and 67 cents, and six, 667 and 95 cents, which is amazing. That's just brilliant savings just by, just by doing this each Wednesday, you know? And um, so that's done. So then what I'm going to do next week, when I will put that 23, I will transfer this, this money into one account and I will still continue to save digitally um, like that. But it's just, I'm not going to keep a track on, um, I'm not just going to keep a track on um, on this. So 
in here and on YouTube. So I'll be just doing this off camera. I'm going to skip this challenge just for a moment, this this uh, colored card dice game. Uh, we doing do this challenge. And for do this challenge, the 2024, I'm saving five for each icon and we need to complete um, two turkeys today. It's perfect, the money is there and that envelope is kept, the money is kept in that envelope uh, and it's going to be kind of added to the car insurance. Well, I think I have enough in this binder anyway, but it's um, this one is more for a bin collection bill for our bin collection uh, company, which they call KWD. So I might um, pay the entire bill in full and just forget about it until October next year. So that's uh, Judy and now we are going to Etsy map and today I want to complete this challenge. Um, I need 5, 10, 15, 20, 5, 30, 5, 40 euros. So I have 40 euros for the Etsy map challenge. Um, there will be a lot of coloring, all right? But um, oh yeah, and before I start coloring, I actually received two new um, orders from two new states out of this map and I thought I'm not going to get it. But I got uh, an order from Maryland and Utah. So that's great. Thank you guys so much. I, <laughs> I love it. This map looks so amazing. So yeah, it's going to be a lot of coloring. I will fast forward. Um, and yeah, I'm so happy to complete this uh, challenge. And we count the money. We will count the money later. Uh, so yeah, bear with me.
that's perfect the entire map is done i'm so so happy uh, so the entire challenge how much in total we saved so we have 20 40 60 81 20 40 60 82 to 20 to 40 to 55 wow love it 255 saved um thanks to you guys that's amazing brilliant and for those of you who just click on that video and you don't know, you don't know why I'm, I was saving using the US map, uh, simply because I have an Etsy shop and I was looking at the orders and I was just looking at the states where the uh, my challenges are going. So yeah, I was short few of the few. What was it? One, two, three, four, five. I think only five states that I didn't. Oh, and Alaska. That's six. I think. I didn't receive and Vermont yeah there was more than six around maybe ten states that I didn't receive the orders from but the rest I can proudly say that my savings challenges are used there to save your hard earned money guys so thank you so much I have that money saved brilliant another challenge done which is great so the Etsy map is done that's brilliant. And now for this binder, I only have Judy's left and this dice um, challenge. I Off camera, I counted how many stickers I have left in these trackers. Well, the purple is done anyway. So five colors, five trackers. I got this a challenge from an Etsy shop called Lunova B, Brittany. And I love this challenge, but it's a big one. It is a big one. So I counted off camera how many stickers I have left here and there are 16. So to finish this challenge by the end of this year, I would need to scratch four stickers each week because we have four weeks, uh, four paychecks in December. So the plan is to do that, but I don't want to surprise myself next week when scratching the numbers. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to, I'm going to scratch for today to know how much, how much money I need for next week. I, th I hope you're okay with that. Um, like I said, the purple is done. And um, so then I'll be continue to do duties and I will probably take this, these two envelopes and move them into the maybe the navy binder where I keep my savings challenges that I'm planning to start very soon, the end of November, uh, December. Um, so yeah, and just to complete the two until the end of um until the end of this uh, this year because I need that binder for my yearly challenge just to get ready um, and be prepared for um, for 2025 so this challenge came with the dice so let me use that dice is it this one no it's not this one it's that one uh, purple is done so oops the purple is done oh it's done Okay, green. I'm going to keep green. So I will be scratching four, uh, four stickers today to know how much money I need for next week. Because my money is gone. I still need to do my dead binder today. And obviously not having any IOU. I just want to complete this challenge. So we have three. Now we move... Actually, actually you know what? I'm going to put on the calculator. So we have three for now and now one from yellow so plus 15 two more green again so plus seven and one more green I don't have any green one more, blue. That's great, we have 10. So plus 10 is 35. So I need 35 euros for these uh, four stickers. And I think it's actually a great, um, it's a great idea. I don't have any sticky notes on me now. No, I don't. But look, I will remember. If not, I will watch my own video and just check how much money I need. So 35 and then we have green and oh yeah, green and purple will be done, which is great. Love it. So then I have 12 left. 
Perfect. So 35 euro going into this challenge next week. And obviously we'll be completing duties uh, as well. So that's great. I love it. Love to see the progress. And 35 isn't too bad. But it, again, for one challenge, it's a big number. So I think I did the right thing just to check the numbers, um, um, how much money I need um, next week. So that's perfect. That's that. And now we need to do my dead binder. And my dead binder... Not, that's not my dead binder. You see, I really want to do this binder. That's why I'm grabbing that one. <laughs> this is my winter one. It's going to be started very soon. My dead binder is here. I um, I was totally fascinated and inspired by Kathy Cruise Budgets. And um, she did her dead binder. She's at the end of her journey. She just set up a dead binder. She's putting 50, she was putting $50 each week. And any completed saving challenge, she was just putting aside. And every so often she was going to the bank and make a kind of a bigger one extra payment on top of her loan, which is amazing. And that's how she paid it quicker. And I'm going to do the same thing. So I have seven envelopes here, seven savings challenges. I will be using challenges where I can set up my own amount or easy to do fives because the five will be put it into each challenge. So here are the... Money, 10, 20, 30, 40, and 50. I will try to have 50 euros each week as well. If not, it's it really, it all depends. Maybe even 55 if I can. So I'm not rolling the dice. Uh, I'm just marking which challenge is going to be next. This is, I'm just using the magnetic book uh, mark. Um, and I'm... Last week I, I finished on this one. So my first five is going to this challenge. And this challenge is from Shan on a budget. That's perfect. This challenge got five, three more apples and one done. Of course, I'm not going to run to the bank with one completed challenge. I will do the same thing as Cathy, just kind of collect them for a while and then I will make one payment and I will put all the money out of the completed saved challenges in my zip binder, in this one, this binder where I keep my uh, debt envelope. So I'll be putting the money in here for to go to the bank every so often and just make an extra bigger payment and hoping to finish this loan definitely quicker. Um, uh, okay, another five. This is Fiona for Galaxy is Life, her beautiful fall uh, freebie. I'll be using a lot of freebies here. I recently uh, created some freebies myself and I also created um, and I also downloaded some freebies from you guys. This community is amazing, so do use your freebies. And um, this one is the road to 1K. A boop in the budget, the hopeful budgeter, and forming new habits. And I am saving five again for each item. There will be a bigger ones, and I'm probably not going to put anything that there's more than 100 euros. It will just take too much time. Um, this one is from Etsy Shop Gold in Creative Ink Scribbles. So I'm putting five. This one saves me 40, so I'm doing one and four. And then, of course, I have two and three for another five. Next one is Pumpkin Love. This was a freebie from Studio Budgets with one of the orders I ordered. And um, for this one, I need... To mark one pumpkin. Okay, so that's going well. And then we move into the front. Another challenge. This one is actually Creative Ink Scribbles as well. Black is my favorite color. This was a set of six. I purchased that one because I just love it. And black is my favorite color. So I can color another paw print. So, so cute. Okay, next one is this freebie from Lainey Bug uh, Budgets. And I'm just saving five for a pumpkin. Okay. 
going back to Shan. Okay, that one, Fiona, Frugality is Life, is going to get five. I'm just putting five here. And my last five is going to this collaboration challenge between two, two, three ladies. And I'm putting my last five in here. So that is perfect. So now this will go. So this challenge was the last one. So I'm putting my bookmark on this envelope. So I'm going to start cash stuffing my dead binder from this challenge next week. So super excited and can wait to finish some savings challenges in here. Now, guys, thank you so much for watching. I know this video is quite long, um, but um, yeah, that's the way how it is. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Make sure to uh, to watch my uh, Christmas um, savings challenge uh cash stuffing video um there is a secret giveaway in there so bye guys take care mind yourself be kind bye bye